Well, hello all my friends, it's Louie here and welcome back to my channel, I really appreciate that. So a couple days ago, I threw a bowl in the last video that I posted and I now wanted to show the trimming process whenever it comes to making things look a lot better on your clay creations whenever you throw them on the pottery wheel. And pretty much the only tool I'll be using is the mud tool. This tool is just one of the best tools that you can actually get for trimming whenever it comes to pottery. And this is the bowl that we threw a couple days ago. It is now leather hard and we will start the process of trimming. So let's get right to it. Okay, so one of the first things we want to do is find a center point for this bowl to set on the wheel. And the easiest method that I found is by using a needle tool. And I'm going to show you how I do that and a lot of other potters do it as well. So you want to get your needle tool and you're going to spin the wheel slowly. And all you're going to do is place your hand, make a really nice adjustment to your hand where it does not move and then just let that tool scratch up against that pot. You're gonna trim away most of them in the process. So you'll see these markings to where that needle tool hit and you just wanna press in where that marking hit. And you'll do this over and over again till eventually you get to that center point and that needle tool will stay in contact with this bowl all the way around or close to all the way around. And I think that's good. Yeah, there's a little wobble, but I didn't center this 100%. This was just something quick that I wanted to do. So you're gonna have a little wobble and this is created by hand, so it's not gonna be perfect. So that's good, centered. And now the next thing, you want a couple pieces of clay to make a secure clamp onto the wheel itself so it doesn't move while you're trimming. I think that's good. So now I'm going to trim a foot on this and that's just going to be the place where this bowl is going to set. We're going to clean it up really good and then we should be done and I'll show you the final product. Like I said, the little points from the needle tool, you'll be able to clean that up very easily.
right, so I think it's now time to flip it over. That's pretty much all there is to it. The trimming a little foot on your bowl, just cleaning it up a little bit. I am nowhere near a professional. I've only been doing this for a few months now. And uh, I'm pretty satisfied with it. It's not perfect. You can definitely tell it's handmade, but that's the beauty of this kind of art. Everything is going to be unique whenever you create it. So yeah, I'm gonna show you a few B-roll shots of it really quick. My friends, that is the process of trimming a bowl. The bowl that I threw in the last video that I created. And uh, if you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section below. If you like this video, please smash that like button. If you wanna see future content, please subscribe. You know it means a lot to me. Make sure you hit the notification bell as well, just so you can see new content whenever I put it onto YouTube. And uh, if you wanna see any kind of content, I'm up for creating anything for you guys to watch, especially in a time like this, where most of us are locked inside. I know things are starting to open now, but I know a lot of people still have a lot of fear. And if I can take away that fear, even for five to 10 minutes on one of my videos, that's something beautiful to me. So yeah. Let me know in the comment section below. Later on.